The day finally arrived, we have the Soccer Manager 2025 available. Today I can upload content from Soccer Manager 2025, and I am going to explain all the news and I will also tell you how you can get the beta. I also have to tell you that this is a beta, and many things can change. And obviously they will improve many others, in addition to perhaps adding new functions for the complete game, you never know. Now, let's start. We're going to go little by little, and we're going to start with the new menu. The main menu looks dynamic and very well organized. We see two new buttons. One of events, which will be very important this year, since many fun events will arrive throughout the year. And another button for more games, where I imagine the company's games will be, such as Champions Elite Football, Soccer Manager Online or Soccer Verse. Let's go with functions. The assignments. Now they work well, you can assign your players without problem. Additionally, if you hire someone with an assignment with an option to purchase, when the assignment ends you will be able to negotiate the contract directly, as seen in these screenshots. Let's go to the directive, and now we have objectives to meet more clearly, which will make the career mode more fun. We have a new currency in Soccer Manager 2025, in this case it is a currency that gives you money for your club's budget. I imagine this currency can be earned for free in events and perhaps by raising your manager's level. This is a great way to progress faster in your career mode for free. A question that I saw very repeated in the community is if the new format of the new Champions League was going to be there, and indeed if it will be in Soccer Manager 2025. It will also be the same as the Europa League and the Conference League in real life. From what I saw in the AI in terms of signings, it is more intelligent. The signings are more realistic, I also saw that the AI transfers players with low ratings but a lot of potential to teams where they will play. We have changed animations in the sponsors and also in the negotiations. When you improve the facilities, you can see how many days you have spent with the improvement and how many days it is in total. The potential of the players is now only seen at their maximum potential, but in the scout report it is seen as always, the minimum and the maximum, so I don't know if it is that the player does not always reach that maximum number or if it is because the scout is not improved, he gives you the possibility of maximum potential, is in evaluation range. What I can say is that the players progress much faster. This is something that was requested a lot and is finally updated. In the create your club mode when you choose a league, for example the Spanish one, the game will fill the team with players from the same country. In this case, the typical players of this game mode will remain the same. The players from Spain are added because I chose to play in the Spanish league. Now let's go to the gameplay, what has changed the most in Soccer Manager 2025. Look how the players are smarter. Before in Soccer Manager 2024 the players were not organized and many spaces opened up in the defense. Now in Soccer Manager 2025 the defense looks much more organized and the players look much more intelligent, in addition to the fact that the graphics have improved. Every time the ball touches the goal net, it moves. This is a very nice detail that makes each goal look more incredible. Obviously between now and the final game there is still a lot to improve, but the game is already very good. This year in Soccer Manager 2025 it is more optimized than ever, more than the famous Soccer Manager 2023, so it will work better on your device. The reason there aren't as many new features this year is that there was a lot of work done to improve the old programming of the game. So with the improvement that Soccer Manager 2025 received from now on they will be able to little by little introduce everything that the community asks for, such as simulating in the calendar. We will talk more about this in another video. The beta has been open to 1000 people. Little by little it will be open to more people. So pay attention to the channel to get the beta, that was all, if you want more from Soccer Manager 2025, subscribe and tell me in the comments what you thought.